this Bluetooth module can easily achieve zero wireless data transmission within 10 meters. Using the module doesn't require knowing the complex Bluetooth bottom agreement. A few simple steps can get you to enjoy the convenience of wireless communication. Now, let's do a simple module test. First, connect this board to computer with a USB cable to download the program. Then, go to Device Manager to check if it is correctly connected. Right-click Computer, go to Properties, click Device Manager, and click Port. You can see Arduino Uno R3 COM6, meaning board is successfully connected. Now, open Arduino IDE, click Tools. For board, select Arduino Uno. For port, select COM6. After selection, you can see here is the same with settings in Device Manager. In here, we can compile a program or directly copy and paste the program. For all of our products, we have supporting files from where you can find sample program for this module. Directly copy the program and paste it here. Click Verify to check compiling mistakes. The codes are correct. Click Upload to upload the program to the board. After uploading is done, let's do the wire connection. First, let's take a look at this module. This module can be used as Bluetooth Master or Bluetooth Slave. You can use key to set up the mode. Here, we skip the setup and use it as a Bluetooth Slave. Now, we need to connect four pins. To connect the VCC to 5 volts, ground to ground, GSD to RX, RXD to TX. When the power is on, you can see the LED on the module is blinking. We also need to download a Bluetooth app called BT Client. First, we go to Settings, turn on Bluetooth, cancel the already paired device, search device. After it's found, click it. Matching pin number is 1234. When it says paired, you can see the LED on the module is blinking quicker than before. Now open BT Client, click pair, search device, click the device and device is paired. In the code, we program the serial monitor to display D-tag when the module receives an A. So let's input A. You can see both the phone screen and the serial monitor is displaying D-tag. Test is now complete. Thank you.